You ready to go, dude? Yeah. All right. It's still, cold. <laughs> it's still cold. It's not very cold. My nose is running. <laughs> hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another one. Today is Father's Day, which I know for you guys, by the time this uploads, it's gonna be gone by a little bit. But it's Father's Day, and we're going on a little father-son pigeon hunt. You excited? Yes. Yeah. But that was really for me to get up. <laughs> it was a little hard for you to get up. Yeah. Um, we probably should be there right now, so I'm gonna hurry up and get this going. Uh, but I want you know, little man, me to be able to get a little bit more sleep. You know, I want to make sure it's fun. So anyway, we're gonna go to the field here in a little bit. We should be set up and uh, get this thing going. We got a bunch of stuff to carry out, don't we? Yeah. We got our buckets. We got our blind. He's got our sticks. His gun. We got my gun. My dive bomb cooler, because you know, we need something to drink. My dive bomb blind bag, because I carry it, it's basically my purse, I use it for everything. And the important dive bomb decoys. Let's get out there, they could be flying anytime. You doing a good job setting in decoys? Mm -hmm. Yeah? You learning? Yeah. yeah. All right, we're almost done setting up. I'll show you here in a minute though. I'm pretty excited. You gonna turn it on? There we go. All right, let's go get hidden and see if we can kill some pigeons, eh? You excited? You tired? Tired in. <laughs> all right, I gotta get all the rest of my camera gear going. I should probably get the bags out of the blind, or the spread, shouldn't I, bud? All right, you get your gun and stuff ready and we'll get rolling. Nope, but they might come over this way. I don't even have the shot cam on yet, but there's birds coming, so I might as well load up. Are they coming, bud? Or they go over the trees? Well, there's another flock behind them. We went a little too far down. I thought they were crossing a little bit closer to this corner. Well, we'll try it. If not, we can move them. We'll figure it out. I'm trying to put this on my head. Here, I can put it on your head for you. Ugh. Got it? There's a group way out there. Hopefully they're not dead set on where they want to go. I know you guys can't see them on GoPro at all, but uh, maybe we'll get a little action out of this. Maybe. What do you think? Will they come? Right on. Oh, there's a good group underneath them too. See them flying real low? But at least not, we're not finding birds. Yeah, we're not finding too many yet. They'll get here. See, there's a white one really low, playing against the ground. Ooh. But they're, hopefully they come over this way. What are those? Those are pigeons. Oh. Got him. <laughs> Right there. Yeah. First one. We got one. He's alive. He no, alive. that boy's dead. That boy is very dead. <laughs> you gonna go get him? Hey, go around that way. Oh yeah, I got you. All right. Well, uh, the pigeons are definitely more interested in the field behind us, oh. but Ooh, this one was the easier alive. walk yet. So this is the one we picked. I didn't want to. I didn't want to wear the man out. Too much. We walked almost a half mile in. Uh, both these fields are planted. I, I mean, I don't want to drive on them. Pick them up by a foot and bring them over. That's not his foot. <laughs> He's not gonna bite you, dude. <laughs> what do we got there? Oh, oh, more pigeons! Come, 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 quick! Anyway, got the first bird down. How about a thumbs up for me and little man? Yeah. Hopefully this hunt works out. It's more about, you know, me and little man being out here than uh, anything else. But I do want to thank a lot of people. I've been wanting to do a sort of thank you to everybody that's helped me on the channel, um, sponsorship wise anyway. Uh, and you know, just give them a good shout out. Like for instance, Die Bomb. Look at all these silos. This is 10 dozen pigeon silos. And we'll do a proper walk through the th uh, spread here in a little bit. This would probably be a whole lot less successful even 
if it wasn't for them. I mean, absolute killer product. Uh, all these people, everyone that I'm mentioning, Dive Bomb, uh, Shot Camp, Ducks, and Paula Plus, all of these sponsors will have a link in the description if you would go check out any of these products because, you know, you guys helping them out helps me out and I really appreciate it. But. These hurt my ears. They hurt your ears? Right, you can take them off head. for a little bit. Just be ready to put them back on when the pigeons come, okay? Hold real still. Real still. Oh, come over, come over. Ready? Oh, I missed twice. Hey, that one's still kind of alive. You better go shoot him, okay? Have you been practicing? Oh, right over the top. Go get him. Run, dude. <laughs> <sighs> I love this. This video, by the way, is more for me than you guys, in case you couldn't tell. So. Yeah, my shooting though, quickly went from 100% to 50% real quick. Get him! Get him! There you go! You're good. Here they come. Hold still. I got two in that last shot. All right. What do you think, dude? Great. Oh, camera. Well, my dude just shot two birds. Down. You have to hold it more out in front of you, dude. No, it looks this. Yep. There you go. We got here. Nice check. There we go. We got a blue bar over here. Out of three shots, I missed once and got three though. So that that, that worked out in the wash. Okay, uh, if the camera footage and everything is jumpy all over the place, I'm concentrating on my kid. Um, yeah, I hope you guys understand because it's him and me out here and I'm having a blast. It, like, it, there's a lot of emotions going on for some reason. Look at him. Oh, please circle back, please circle back. You think they'll come back? We think they'll dip. We'll find out. They left. Ready? You tell me to kill him. Kill. You snap. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> oh my goodness uh so i'd say uh i hit that one boy that one might not have anything left for eating feel kind of bad about letting him get that close man anyway uh so just in case you're curious what i'm shooting today we have the old impala plus here another great company that i've been working with um they have treated me really really well and so far um, I actually have a video coming up here in the very near future where I will tell you more of my thoughts on it. So, you know, if you want to know more about the gun, stick around. That video will be coming up here probably in actually, it might be a couple weeks. Oh my goodness, dude. Oh my goodness. We'll just go ahead and set him there. You can show them on your camera, okay? But anyway, they have treated me really well. And I, so far, have been very impressed with the product. Yeah. I'm running a kick's high plier out of it. 
Um, I'm actually shooting Fiacci. Yeah, anyway, link in the description or in a couple of videos, you should check them out there. Pigeons, pigeons. All right, another one. Well, I should probably reload, actually. These are kind of fun because they're kind of you know, clear, so you can see what's in them. Um, so far, they're treating me really well, actually. Another one of the people I want to thank, Shot Cam. That camera right there. Uh, the reason a lot of my videos are worth anything, uh, when, I'm, when you're shooting pigeons, dove, starlings, you know, small stuff like that, the GoPro makes it so, makes them look so far away, like you almost can't see them. Like I try and zoom in, which you guys watch any of my videos really probably already know this. Like it's really hard to get good footage off a GoPro. And unless you have a cameraman, it's pretty rough. This camera here, super easy to use. All I gotta do is bump my gun. It starts recording if I shoot. It doesn't record unless I shoot. And then it also is like times four magnification. Yeah, anyway. They have made my life a whole lot easier. Big thanks to Shot Cam. So hopefully we'll get a few more birds in and we'll give a thanks to our next person. There we go. That pigeon, that pigeon was a little hesitant. So uh, I wasn't sure my camera was rolling. Anyway, another one. All right, here, come, here comes a trio. But they're doing it good. That thumbs up worthy, right? Hold on, one more, bud. <laughs> now it's thumbs up worthy. Sitting here still shoving shells in my gun from that last little bit. There we go. Sorry guys, I couldn't help but use the aimbot today. You know, after that first couple misses. But you know, I got a video to make. I got, I just gotta turn it back on. He just shot birds. Four birds at one time. Oh, God. Can you help me, Dad? Oh my goodness. Where are they? Never mind, he just got five. Well, where are the other bird? I already got this bull right. Oh, yeah, he's prettier than I thought he was. Then look at him. Sorry, guys. Oh, there he is. Ooh, I better put this down. Yep. Oh, this has to be closed. Nice shot! Way to go, dude! <laughs> Domed that thing! Man, I hope the camera was rolling. Way to go! All right, did you get all four of them? Nope. All right, let's go pick them up. Here's the one I picked. Okay, let's go find the other two real quick. You want that one or a different one? I want to try a different one. You want to try a different one? All right, I'll drink this one. 
Let's see what else we have in here. Um, what's that? I have Snapple. You want that? Or you want me to try and dig for one of those watermelon green teas? One of those? Okay, let's see what I can find. Well, that water is cold. Is that what you're looking for? <laughs> We're gonna rehydrate, because that's important. And hopefully get some more birds to show up. All right, so little man's headphones were hurting him. I need to give him a proper set. So he is rocking my ear protection. So one of these days, I'll pick up an extra set. I just did not, I did not think he had outgrown that. Maybe you just got a big head. You ever thought about that? Yeah. Hmm? <laughs> He does have a big head though. He was in like the 99th percentile. There we go. We were counting birds and that one snuck up on us. You got him? 14th bird. 14th bird. Little man's on it. Boy, that is way louder. I think this one, yeah, this one's coming in. Look at him do it. Hold real still. Ready? Yeah. Oh. Got him. That was nice. <laughs> I hope he loves this as much as I do. If he's loving this half as much as I do. All you dads out there, I think you probably know what I'm talking about. Uh, this video is going to be long, in case we're not at that point yet. It's gonna be a long video. What's up? Where's my camera? I don't think so. Hold on, technical difficulties. So, that brings us to my next thank you. Uh, Ducks Waterfowl. They make a ton of hats, apparel. I've worn, like, if you guys watch the channel for any length of time, for about excuse me, for about the last two years, very, very seldomly will you not see me wearing one of their hats, one of their shirts, uh, their sweats. They're coming out with, maybe I shouldn't say that. They're coming out with a whole bunch of new stuff uh, that I shouldn't tell you about probably. But anyway, big thanks to them. They've helped me out a ton. They've given me lots of help and just pointers and you know, help me out with the channel. So big shout out to them as well. Like this shirt here, this is one of their performance uh, long sleeve tees. It's a polyester, I think it's polyester. I don't know, it's that really nice stretchy fabric. And it is so breathable. Like, I'm out here, I don't know how you're in a hoodie, dude. Like, what in the world? Are you not hot? I'm hot. Okay, well take that thing off. You might wanna take your hat off first, though. Uh, but this, this shirt here, it's really light, breathable. It just lets the air through so nice. I mean, it's almost like not wearing a shirt. So anyway, big thanks to Ducks for helping me out all the time. Yeah. I think that's pretty much all the people that I need to really, really give a shout out to. So, um, if not, then I am dreadfully embarrassed and sorry. So, anyway, hope we get some more action. But, I mean, we got ourselves a little pile going. Yeah. I did not want to hit that bird I just had to shoot in the head. <laughs> you domed him. <laughs> He's pretty pumped about it. <laughs> Me too. Oh the old turkey buzzard coming and checking out all the, the dive bombs. You Good should. thing we hided those. <laughs> you think you'd eat our birds? <laughs> I think your safety's on, bud. Your safety's on. That was a poke. I shouldn't have done that. Oh, he's coming back. What in the world? He wants to fight you. <laughs> he wants to fight me? You need to see if you can get him. No, he went into the trees. We'll have to go see if we can find him real quick. Maybe I can aim better this time. Oh, 
Boy! Oh, he's still alive. Go get him. Go get him. Oh, I need to concentrate on my shooting because, wow, I just got a whole lot worse. I am sorry, guys. That was not good. Ah, oh, how did I miss again? Is he coming back? He is coming back. They're coming over. Hold still, hold still, hold still. Oh, I was gonna wait for the two. Here we go. Hold on, there's another. Okay, go ahead. All right. Just in case, I think he's dead, dead. <laughs> so it's been real slow. We've been talking about maybe calling it, but we thought we'd hang out for a little bit longer. And no one came in. Kid's got a great eye. He's starting to pick pigeons out from a long ways off. He's got some promise in him. Take it, take it, take it. I should have. I should have listened to my shot caller. He's thirsty. That one's done though. There we go. You gonna go get that one? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't think I've showed you guys our blind situation yet. I've had this uh, camo blanket, camo netting. I'm not sure what you call it. It's pretty much just uh, oh, kind of like a gunny sack material, except in camo pattern. Ouch, something bit me on the back of the leg. Um, but yeah, just got it propped up with some of our uh, bamboo-ish cane type sticks. Uh, keeps his head pretty well. You got him? Nice little blue check there. Right on. Oh my goodness. Get them, get them. Well, let's see if they come back. Will they come back in? We'll, we'll take what we can get. Please be ready. Please be ready. Oh, I missed that last one. Got two. Yeah. You think any will come back? Here, hold on a little bit. Let's let them. Let's let them circle a little bit and see if any come back. Um, Ooh, that was a good group, bud. Yeah. Okay. Well, these guys came back and checked us out. Yeah. All right. Well, a lot of these birds are going back to water, and by the time they see us, they are very much so like. We're thirsty, we're not gonna go hang out. But as you can see, some of them, some of them are coming out and checking out the old spread. I love the way this thing looks. I'll tell you, five dozen is good. I've hunted over five dozen for a while. 10 dozen, whoa. Good grief, here they are. See the white one yet? Nope. There she is, there she is. I missed the white one. Good eye, dude. I just flat out missed it. I didn't see him coming. He was all the way at the end. Well, I got one. Well, that was like the last group that I knew was out in the field still. And we've been waiting on, there's a, it's a black-tailed white grizz that's in that group. We've been watching him for like 20 minutes. So he was all amped up, amped, amped up to see that bird. And yeah, I'm sure Shotcam will show you, you know, some beautiful tree clipping uh, footage there. 
But I think that's probably most of it. We're gonna take a quick look around the field, see if we can see any more birds out. Haven't seen any more coming out to the field because it's getting hot a little bit later in the morning. So uh, yeah, maybe we'll get a few more birds. Uh, if not, you know, we got stuff to pick up. What do you got? Nice blue bar? Huh? I don't know where the blood is. Oh, there. <laughs> You're all about wondering where that, where he got hit at, huh? Yeah. yeah. All right, well, we just did a quick look around the field and we are not seeing any more birds. Think it's about time to pick up? But vultures. Yes, we have been seeing vultures. There are plenty of turkey buzzers out cruising around. Uh, anyway, we're gonna get this stuff picked up and uh, we'll talk to you here in a bit. Got a little man on a uh, shell pickup duty. You gonna get them all? Try to. <laughs> Absolutely. So while he's picking that up, I'm gonna pick up our spread and uh, we're gonna get back to the truck and then we'll get a little recap from the little man himself and see uh, what he thought. <sighs> we are getting everything all packed up. It's getting hot, isn't it, bud? Huh? How many birds we get? 22. 22? Was a lot of fun? Yes. Yeah? You about, you about ready for another drink, huh? Yeah? I'm go help yourself. Drink. Huh? You go get a drink, go sit in the shade. <sighs> He's a trooper. Here is the pile, though. Good old 22 bird day. There was one that went in the trees that I couldn't find. Um, but other than that, you know, pretty successful. A lot of the birds really close i'm really happy with the way that today turned out but again i would not have a pigeon spread if it wasn't for dive bomb go ahead check them out they help me out a ton and i really appreciate them i mean they have made i mean i honestly i probably wouldn't get a hunt about a third as much uh or have as much success as i do if it wasn't for them so yeah big shout out to them so much fun anyway if you guys like this video you guys know what to do Hey bud, if they like it, what are they supposed to do? Click the thumbs up. What else? Um, subscribe if you haven't. And? I, I will see you on the next one. Heck yeah!